Hello guys, Ronnie here and welcome to your 15th C++ tutorial where we are going to look at pointers, arrays and pointers arithmetic. So uh, we looked at arrays in a couple of tutorials back and if you can remember if we say uh, this is an, uh, an array is uh, created, let's say array, array and I put uh, let's say three numbers, three variables to be. Uh, and then I put the elements here. I say four, for example, six, and uh, I guess eight or nine. I guess. Then I close that. So now this is where our pointers come in. So if I say, if I do this, for example, if I call out, um, I put a pointer here. A pointer array and I compile this guess what comes out 4 I get a 4 this 4 is the first number here which is um, array 0 now this this uh, this process is called dereferencing an array all right so it returns the first value which is array uh, 0 alright so I just thought I'd throw that in anyway moving on um, we want to create a pointer here and I just want to show you something real quick this is actually a uh, pointers arithmetic alright so let's say for example we have a pointer uh, let's say first of all we have a variable here uh, an integer let's say integer Ronnie let's call it Ronnie again equals uh, 5 all right and then we say integer let's make a pointer here Ronnie PTR pointer equals to and uh, uh, Ronnie and then we see out Ron I mean we, we already did this all around so it's not anything new at all. See out and uh, running actually. Uh, um, and running. So let's compile this and see what we get. So we get this address uh, location hold uh, being held by the pointer. Now, what if I say, um, see out uh, now let's look at a situation where we can perform an addition uh, to this uh, using these pointers let's say for example we um, say see out um, Ronnie PTR and then we say plus one and actually uh, end this line and line. I'll copy that again and uh, control C. I'll copy that like uh, paste that, paste that, and paste that. So say plus two here, plus three, plus four. So let's try to compile this and see what we get. Now, as you can see here, I get. 18, 1C, 20, 24, 28. Now, what I'm getting to is um, 1C plus 4 is equal to 18 in hexadecimal. What uh, actually 18 plus 4 is equal to 1C in hexadecimal? Is it? <laughs> actually, it's the other way around. It's 1C plus that. So see there's an increment of 4 20 24 28 that means that that means that the integer is four bytes in my computer so it depends on the machine that you're using sometimes the, an integer can be eight uh, on different machines so it doesn't really matter um, the 32 bits computer ha um, have a full bit uh, as the as the integer. Uh, if you put this as short, it will be two. Double is eight. Um, 
and so on and so forth all right I don't know if I was really clear in this video I don't know if you really got anything out of it but if you did not I mean don't panic just send me a message or or uh, on my YouTube message uh, box inbox and I'll be glad to help you if you don't understand anything so thanks again guys for watching this videos make sure you do practice uh, rate comment and subscribe so I'll see you in my next video till then stay tuned